I just noticed that our holdings alone in Desmohain Urmunhain give us 9,000 troops. All these beautiful castles we have built. I am very happy with that. What do we need next? Keeps improved keeps for. Oh! Well, would you look at that? Got the money for that. And I think it's pretty much the one that we really need. Improved keeps four or five is what keeps us. Castle infrastructure too, but since with improved keeps we get keeps, that gives us another plus 20% in levy size. That's huge. That is huge. At this point, this is huge. Let's research this. Let's check out some more things to put research into because it's open. Melee techniques, skirmish techniques. It's not really something I care all that much about. Light cavalry attack is not bad, but morale and morale defense, I feel, are a little bit more interesting. And we'll go the infantry route here. We should be the most advanced with that as well. And we will not read the Valdesian Bible. Yeah, we are the most advanced in infantry technology. And castle infrastructure and improved keeps those are spreading. That's good. Now we can build keeps. Not many keeps because we don't have the money, but we check it out now. Oh, it already went up by a hundred or so. So we have 3,120 now. Let's build one keep and check out what the additional 20% will do. Because I'm really, really bad with numbers. And while I probably could figure it out, I'm not going to try. Our threat is still above 50, so we're not going to go anywhere right now. We might actually... Let's check out. Who's your du jour area? Just this. Are you at war with someone? No. How's your rebellion going? Oh, you're fighting many people. None of this is going to go well. Oh, he's actually winning against the tyranny of Bacha Suleiman of Hispania. Not bad. Not bad at all. I like this big Spanish blob in here. Really like it. The Sultan Abdul of Germany. Check the Sultanate of Germany. It's all this. That's just amazing. Man. You have some clear mounts? Ooh, yes! Thomas! He's a bit old. But maybe we can keep him alive. Let's invite him to court. We just need to go... Below 50 to start a war with Hispania to press his, this man's claim. Let's find your wife. Let us find you a wife. Let us build your wife. Let's present a debiton. Cost us a bit of money. Why suddenly do we have a lot more options? Ah, wouldn't have needed that. Let's find him someone youngish. Youngish and goodish. Er. Uh, Now he needs a title. 
needs a title within our county. We could give him Suffolk. But we will wait until we can prepare for war. Let's check if the war is there for us. Claim. Claim, 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 claim. Nope. Oh, we have a truce with him too? How long? Ah, almost gone anyway. So this man... Let's... I think I can press his claim in war. Should be able to at least. Is Alemania? No, that's just a Bavaria. Why is there no Germany? I'm a little bit confused because I don't see his claim. A bit odd. There's some du jour claims for smaller pieces. Oh. Where is this man? Can I not press your claims? I'm a little bit reluctant to give him this county on a whim. Why are we more threatening? I oh, know it's going on. Okay, let's let's try this. Let's give him the county of Suffolk because if he dies anyway. He will be giving it back to me, I believe. Oh, he has an heir. Is it going to leave me now? No. He's not there. Yes. A safe peasant is a productive peasant. We need to get realm prosperity back up. Okay, so now he's in here. Not a de jure claim that we can press. But rather an actual claim. Ah, wrong guy. Their war. Come on, where's Germany? I mean, it's in alphabetical order, so it should have been there already. Really odd. Why well, can't I go to war for Germany? What? He is... Revolting against his liege? No, he's not. Don't lie to me. Let's see. Turius, Aragon. French Comte. Galatia. Genoa.
Mm. I'm displeased. I thought we could do something really funny with this. Cannot. Let's give him the vassalage then. We don't really care for him anymore. Have this man. We need to leave, leave a little room with our holding size. Because while we still have a lot of holdings from just our lows, the high stewardship rank does add to as well. So that might go away uh, with our air. Doesn't look like it, but it might. Do you never really know? Genius wife waiting for him. We have the war focus. Why do we not get another... Great, yeah. How's our aunt doing? Let's check her out. She's at war with someone again. And how is that war going for you? 25% in favor for Queen Finnecht. Well, so far, I believe she is the only one involved in that war. Come on, guy, stop excommunicating her. Honestly. Yeah, she likes us for that. Not enough. I just want this title so I can form the Holy Roman Empire. I don't know what your issue is. Why don't you want to love me? Put in some commanders here. I think I saw a siege guy just now. Negotiate with whom? Where's those raiding scum? There. How's Pomerania doing? Uh, not, not too great. Thought they had more pieces down here. I think they're being taken apart by the surrounding pagan. Swords. Why is there no Germany in here? Just really upsetting. I don't know why. Oh well. Cannot be helped. We introduced some German blood to the island. Fair enough. Grand Mausoleum is almost built. Almost done. Looks much more done over here on this small little progress bar. Oops. I'm holding down on a button here. Which jumps through all the great works apparently. I did not notice. So... What was built just now? Wasn't our... I think the castle town down here. No, not down here. Over here. Build walls. Right, are you or with Saxony? French Saxon de jure holding war over Paris. So he's attacking someone over this PCM. Okay. For you? You're one of my commanders, but not one of my best. So go with our blessing and join the knightly order. It'd be cool if you could play as a holy order member. Music is a bit more grandiose than the situation warrants. But I like it regardless. 
Oh, look what happened here. Little pieces splintering, huh? No longer king of the castle, are you? What could we do with you? The Lollard Heresy. Uh, go extort tribute against just the whole of the Muslim world. No. Ah. Sorry, our sweet cat. Ranth should be fine doing this. They are my largest vassal. There are some vassals within France fighting each other. What else can we do to decay threat? I don't think we can actually do anything. Oh yes, very good. History is a subject that has always fascinated me and I have spent the last few weeks studying the campaigns of Alexander the Great. There are many lessons to be learned from his conquests in the East. So let us devote more time to studying this indeed. As he is grow growing older, I can see that Con, our dear son, could use some guidance. Huh. Let's see, we can lose a bit of patience to give him patience, which is a really, really good trait. Let's teach him patience. We are out of it, but only for five years we can deal with it. We had 3,000, almost 3.3 thousand. The Order of St. Anthony. King Negus of Abyssinia. All right. Interesting. The Heretic Holy Order. Oh, we have prisoners again. They shall all eventually die in our dungeons. I want to kill the Prince of Alba. Yeah, that's probably what we got the warning about. You? End your plot. He's not going to. Well, we have a 65% chance of imprisoning him, and thus, we have him, which ends his little plot there, saving our dear boy. There, there's a siege leader and a good defender as well. Good. Doesn't have a lot of martial, but just for leading defenses, is this is the perfect combination because both. Sieging is going to be sped up, and if the sieges are jumped, there's good defense in there. If only he had more martial, he would be perfect. How's your war going? Winning, I see. Good. Only these two dinky kings here. Let's see if we can plot to revoke a few king titles at home. I'd rather put up new kingdoms that are a little bit more cohesive than whatever the hell is going on out here. So what plots do we have? Revoke some counties, but no kingdom. Plot some people. Oh, 
he would like to have a seat on the council. Are you good at something, man? You are all right at stewardship, but so is the other guy. You're a terrible spy. You're not great at many things. You'll survive. You'll survive my neglect. Whoops. I just put him down as Marshal. On accident. Oh well. Okay. <laughs> ah, it wasn't... It wasn't my intention. Let's check our realm tree. Who's who's the strongest? Should be our Viceroy. And so he is. And he loves us dearly for it. Doesn't even want a seat on the council. No, he has a seat on the council. I like that the Prince Archbishop over here in the lands that once belonged to us is the third strongest vassal above kings. I like that. That's really cool. Oh, he loves this. Can we request a claim on something cool? On one of the kingdoms, yeah. Nothing else, really. He loves us dearly. Why do you love us so? Ported him. No, I really didn't. That's alright. Let's check our family tree a little bit. Male Petich. Here. The first emperor. Aibre. Can we go deeper in this? All by going through the tree. It wasn't there. This male Petir is actually the first emperor. And I think this is where we started out with. Didn't we? Queen Elbrick of Ire. Oh no, we had a. Yeah, we had a short little stint down here. Where we actually weren't. Yes, yeah, Skerak the Hollow. Yeah, there, there she is. And there's Erikan. Little trip down memory lane. And I think he was the first. Actually. When did he die? 822. Yeah, he was the first one. Was he? No. I don't know. I don't remember. I think it was Erdogan. Who was our first. Yeah, they are the Finneachts. It was Erdogan. And then came the blessed Garak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had all the bishops. Was it, was it him? It was either him or him. One of these two. Alright. Yes, more prosperity at home. Need that to go up. Right. For some reason, our potential troops have gone down by more than 700. Oh, right. No, not some reason. Uh, we put up a terrible marshal. Which destroyed our martial rating from something 50 plus to 28. Ah, uh, 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 that, that one happened. Good, yeah, but... Now we get a direct comparison, so... 2,700... Almost 2,800 versus... 2,600. So that's 200 more, just to keep. Good. My wife is an apostate. Well, I suppose she dies then. 
And we shall find a new and better wife. New and improved. Okay, we need someone who can offset the military issue here. What did she have before? 11. So anyone with above 11 military will will be our choice. She can be older too. But it's of course ideal if she's good at other things as well. She's the better choice. Plus she's homosexual. Wrong religion, but that's okay. We can afford a little bit of prestige damage. Right, there's a crusade against our religion, the crusade for Italy. These are the defenders. And we shall most certainly join the defense. So we are at 3,407% strength. And we just added almost another thousand there. Oh, that's... That's a whole lot of people there. The Grand Empire of Alba will have none of this. Oh, I wish I could build another here. Have an even more keeps there. Upgrade. Evermore. Well, okay, that's uh, that's an interesting turn of events. Our son has become an intricate web weaver and he's a homosexual. That's not great. A little bit suboptimal. Baptized by Ennio, not really grand or anything. Bunch of strong claims going for himself. What was I about to do? Building another keep here. And another keep here. We need to keep our home keep strong. And thus we have groomed our air. Time to turn our attention elsewhere. I believe we should build a war chest. Which, once it is finished, gives us a national tax modifier of plus 10% for about five years after we finish it. That's good. Sad that defending in Crusades doesn't give as much as attacking in Crusades. But we'll ever, forever be happy to aid our aunt in whichever way we can. He's fighting for Pomerania. Bania is carving out pieces up here. Oh man. But she herself isn't threatened at least. Let's make her a special interest. Here she is. She likes us, we're in the same dynasty, we have the same interests. All not enough. Right, okay. I woke up this morning, my hands and feet were bleeding and there's a sharp pain in my side. What is happening to me? It is Tukmata. I am blessed by God. Let's become zealous. Marshal plus two. That's fine. We don't need other people hating us. Or liking us, for that matter. It decreased her opinion of us. Cynical versus zealous. Okay. Can live with it. Oh, she's one-handed. He is such an amazing woman. How is he? Not the greatest. But he's keeping the bloodline alive. Oh, a dwarf. Good girl. Who's France fighting now? The French... He's attacking the daughter of Satan. Wait, did she die? Oh no, she died of severe stress. Oh. So now he rules 
And... He also gets the cool thing. What? God damn it. Can you stop taking pieces out of my land? Seriously, it's always the island. Always the island. Take from Britain. From home. Oh. Hello there. The Byzantines are going to help. The Knights Templar. The Kingdom of Jerusalem. Everyone, basically. It's all because we are so threatening. Okay, we need to survive a little while longer and then we'll go get ourselves Italy. And add that to the Alba pile. And then we will attempt to form the Holy Roman Empire. 